Good morning children and welcome to all of you in online classes. Dear students, we are discussing about first chapter of Flamingo book and the name of chapter is the last lesson. Dear students, I have told you the summary of this lesson and I hope you must have written in your notebook and today dear students I will teach you line by line but before starting the lesson once again I want to tell you ki the name of chapter is the last lesson but it is the first chapter of your flamingo book and this lesson was written by Alfonso Dudet, who was a great story writer, poet, as well as a well-known novelist. Or he worked a lot for the France and for the freedom of France. This particular writer, Alfonso Dudet was very much upset. Upset for what? He was very much upset and pained at the France defeat against Prussia. So all these things I taught you, dear students, and I told you yesterday. And today, line by line, please open your book. Here is given, I started for the school very late that morning and was a great dread of scolding. I means here the narrator. Our narrator is here Mr. Little French. So Mr. Little French who is the narrator of this, of this story, he started for his school at that morning very late and he was frightened frightened with his teacher why he was frightened with teacher why he was thinking that his teacher will scold him the reason behind it is that mr hamel his teacher his stick teacher and dedicated teacher had given him homework on the topic participle but he has not done that homework due to that he was frightened Due to that, he was in fear that a teacher will scold him. And here is given, ki he, Mr. Hamel said that he would question on participle or Mr. Mr. Little French did not know the first word of participle. The first uh, word of participle and, and I did not know about them and he was not knowing what is actually participle is. But when the teacher taught in the class, he was not serious about that. But how then how he will do the homework? The big question. Due to that, there was a fear. Or after that, dear students, there was a chance in hand of Mr. Little French to not go to school. Here is given. Ki for a moment I thought of running away and spending the day out of doors because he has not done homework. So there was a chance in his hand, there was a uh, in his hand to not go to school and not to face his strict teacher, but instead of that, he could go any other place and he could spend his day there only. Or it was a warm and so bright. There was a good opportunity also. The birds were chirping at the edge of woods. And, and the Persian soldiers were do, drilling. The Persian soldiers, they were, they were drilling. At the back of sawmill. So there was a chance in front of Mr. Mr. Little French 
to not go to school and not to face a strict teacher or instead of that he there was a chance that he could is he could spend his time in any other way on any other place but he could not do or finally he moved towards the school what happened after that and he i and he was in hurry and hurriedly he was moving forward to the school but dear students one important point is here ki when i passed the town hall when mr little french reached to the town hall and and he saw that one more surprising thing and one more uh, negative thing was in front of him or that was कि देर वॉज अ बिग क्राउड नियर द बुलेट इन बोट वेन आई पास द टाउन हॉल देर वॉज अ क्राउड इन फ्रंट ऑफ बुलेट इन बोर्ड और वाई द राइटर वॉज अपसेट टू सी दिस क्राउड टू सी दिस गैदरिंग बिकॉज मोस्ट ऑफ द न्यूज ही रिसीव्ड इन टू इयर्स फ्रॉम द बुलेट इन बोर्ड दे वेयर दे मेड अपसेट टू हिम तो ओनली ओनली एंड ओनली सैड न्यूज एंड बैड न्यूज एंड नेगेटिव इनफॉर न्यूज ही रिसीव फ्रॉम दैट बुलेटिन बोर्ड एंड वंस अगेन आफ्टर सींग द क्राउड द सेम थॉट एंड द सेम फीलिंग्स केम इन द माइंड ऑफ मिस्टर मिस्टर लिटिल फ्रेंच ड्यू टू दैट हियर ही इज टेलिंग कि दैट फॉर लास्ट टू ईयर्स ऑल आवर बैड न्यूज हैड कम फ्रॉम देयर मीन्स they had received all the negative and bad news through that bulletin board and after seeing that crowd once again the negative thoughts came in the mind of mr little french but instead of uh, uh, suppose going and seeing and pointing out what is what was written on that bulletin board what was the sad and bad news for his him and his people he decided not to go there he decided not to uh, suppose uh, make uh, spoil his day or in instead of going to that bulletin board he directly moved towards the school or that here is given ki bad news had come from there the last battles are draft of draft the orders of commanding officer i thought myself without stopping what can be what can be the matter now means the thought was uh, once again the negative thought was in the mind of mr little french ki what could be the bad news and sad news this time as but i as i have told you ki that he decided not to go there or hurriedly he moved moved towards the school what happened then or then as i hurried by as fast as i could go the blacksmith watcher who was watching who has already read the contents news written on the bulletin board that particular person interrupted mr mr little french watcher who was there with his apprentice with his assistant reading the bulletin board called after him and what he said how he commented don't go so fast mr little french you will get your school plenty of time this statement was taken by mr little french negatively dear students or he thought that he was getting late due to that due to that mr uh, uh, black smith is passing such type of comment mr little french thought that black smith was making fun of him due to that he increased his speed or what happened finally i thought he was making fun of me and i reached to mr hamel's little garden all out of breath in hurry or finally dear students after reaching there what was the scene near the school 
usually when the school began there was a great bustle there was a great commotion there was a great noise or which could be heard out in the street the opening up and closing of the desks and lessons repeated by the students in a loud voice and many act other activities school related activities could be heard could be seen when the school used to run in normal days but on that day the situation was completely changed when little mr little french reached there what happened ki there was no commotion there was no disturbance there was no noise but in street of that dear students there was a complete silence or here is given ki but of course that everything was everything was uh, suppose quite still and it was seeming that there was a sunday or holiday as on sundays and holidays there is a complete silence and no other activities no commotion and no disturbance either inside or outside of the school the same thing was seen and observed by him or through window he saw whenever he reached and entered in the school campus he found that his friends his classmates were sitting in the class where is written ki i saw my classmate had already in the year places and mr hamel was walking up with his ruler with his terrible ruler terrible iron ruler under his arm a writer decided to open the gate but there was a fear in his mind he was thinking that he was late and the teacher will surely and certainly punish him what happened i had to open the door and go before everybody you can imagine the right mr little french is thinking ki ab a boy a student who is actually late comer and reached school late or whenever he used to enter in the class how he used to feel he used to feel a saint the same type of uh, uh, feeling was in the mind of mind of mr little french he was hesitating to enter in the classroom in front of his teacher and in front of other students other classmates but anyhow he stood courage or he opened the door or he was expecting that his teacher will surely and certainly scold him but here dear students the teacher did not punish him the teacher did not treat him negatively or mr little french got the chance to enter in the class i jumped over the bench and sat at my desk finally he reached to his place not till then when i had got a little over my fright did i see that our teacher had on his beautiful green coat up after entering and after get sitting on his seat then mr little friends the narrator of the lesson he decided to observe the condition of class he decided to see his teacher or he found a very strange thing or strange thing was ki that his teacher was in beautiful coat in best suit or that and with wearing hat or that he used to wear dear students on special occasions on inspection day on prize days result distribution days day 
he used to wear such type of special dress his teacher mr hamel to first surprising thing first strange strange thing or that and one more thing is there dear students ki but the thing that surprised the right uh, narrator most more than that the dress of his teacher here is given ki on the bank bank back benches that there that were always empty the village people sitting quietly like ourselves normally normally usually the back benches of the back benches of the classroom of mr little french they were empty nobody was there to sit but on that day many villagers many old people they came they were sitting they occupied the place or who were there old hasar with three cornered hat and farmer mayor postmaster and several other besides or everybody looked sad when the when mr little french observed the face of them he concluded in his mind that everybody either it was the old hasar or it was the may, farmer mayor or it was the postmaster everybody was sad mr mr little french was unable to know why there was a serious atmosphere why teacher was not uh, giving punishment to him why he was in serious mood why the people who were sitting at the back they were they were they were uh, very serious and sad the reason was dear students because it was the last class of french last french class or it was the last lecture of mr hamel's life this was the reason of seriousness this was the reason of sadness or those people they came to to definitely uh, give their services give their uh, dedication and give their tribute to mr hamel for his 40 years services and here here is given ki while i was wondering about it mr hamel mounted his chair he bent up to his chair and in a serious tone in a gentle tone he used to say he said to he informed mr hamel who was uh, very much strict before now on that day in a serious tone in a serious mood he uh, suppose announced that it was his last lesson my children this is the last lesson i shall give you this this said this surprising information was given by this shocking information was given by given by mr mr hamel to the all students after that little french the narrator of the lesson he knew about that the order has come or what was the reason why he informed this because he he told uh, them ki the order has come from the berlin because the government uh, has been changed now now the new government and new system was uh, implemented the order has come from the berlin to teach only german in the school not to french especially especially in the schools of schools of elsock and loren the new master will come tomorrow the new master will come tomorrow or he informed that it was their last class dear students so this is this is all about this lesson and tomorrow i will tell you the remain next portion thank you dear students